Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to install Software Update Point. Software Update Point, one of the role in MSCM that will help us to deploy updates to client computers. Software Update Point basically works with WSUS. You know, these days, cyber crime happening all over the globe. So we have to make sure our computers are up to date. Microsoft basically release updates on second Tuesday every month for operating systems like Windows 7, Windows 10, Windows 11 and server operating systems. Also for applications like Microsoft Office 365 and Microsoft Visio project like etc. Like, like these uh, applications also uh, Microsoft releasing the updates. Microsoft making OS update and application update. Let's assume if we have 10,000 devices on Bangalore office and 50,000 machines on US office and Microsoft released updates and our responsibility is to install but we can't say users to download and install the updates. So we have to have WSUS server to communicate with Microsoft update server on the internet. It will communicate and bring updates from Microsoft update server. Updates will come to WSUS server. Then WSUS will start scanning all the internal computers and then store the information in database. In previous videos, we have installed WSUS. Basically to integrate WSUS into SCM, that's the reason we are installing software update point on SCM. From SCM, we can deploy updates on all over client machines. So let's go guys, we will do practical now. So guys, uh, this is my SCM server where I have opened Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager. And now here we have to click on administration in that you have to expand this site configuration and click on servers and site system roles in that you can see these two options like in this three roles are already installed in in this you can see seven roles are already installed now uh, wait let me expand this one here you can see that component server distribution point management point service connection point site server site system and sms provider now here we have to install software update point for the patch update for that right click on it and click on add site system roles now you have to click on next again click on next and here you have to check it on software update point software update point is integrated with windows server update services ws us to provide software updates to configuration manager clients click on next by default it's showing port numbers so leave it as it is and here you have to click on which connection you are using like if you are using intranet then click here if you are using internet then click on the second option if you want to allow internet and intranet client connections then you have to click on this third option as of now we are uh, moving with the uh, allow internet only client connections then click on next so if we have installed ws US server on the other like dedicated server that time we have to clear, click on here and we need to enter the path but in our case in SCM server only we have installed WS US server so that's the reason we have to click on next so this option is for synchronize from Microsoft update server click on next and here we need to check this option and even we can change the dates as well in our case it will check every seven days for the updates and check here and click on next click here and click here immediately expire the super sended feature updates click on next
you click on download both full files for all approved updates and express installation files for windows 10 or later and here you have to click on this critical updates and security we both like these two features we need and then click on next and expand this one and expand microsoft as well and check here and again click on uncheck and then select for better you expand this one and uh, check on windows 10 because uh, in our client function we are using windows 10 that's the reason we have to check on windows 10 option again click on next and here you have to select in which language we need updates in our case we need updates on english language okay we go next so we go next let it process So this task has been completed. Now close this option. And I will do one thing, just right click on it. And I'm going to refresh this one. Yeah, here now you can see it's updated to seven to eight means now software update point has been installed. Here you can see which one we have installed software update point which is responsible for patch updating and even we can see the logs for checking the logs we have to open this file explorer click on c drive program files microsoft configuration manager and here search for logs click on continue here just scroll down so here you can see sup setup is the main log file let me open this one here you can scroll down here you can see the log file which is installation was successful and one more main log file which is wcm just double click on it and here you can see all the logs basically uh, from this log you can check SSCM and WSUS connectivity and software update point and WS connected or not so guys today we have installed software update point okay.